हे गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट टर्मिनेशन ऑफ रेप्लिकेशन इन यू कैरियर्स एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय वीडियो सो यू कैरियटिक रेप्लिकेशन हैज थ्री स्टेप्स जस्ट लाइक प्रो कैरियर्स इनिशिएशन इलांगेशन एंड टर्मिनेशन इन आवर लास्ट टू लेक्चर्स we have discussed about the initiation and elongation today we will focus on termination part if you missed the previous lectures i would highly recommend you to go through them in order to understand today's lecture in a better way so we have seen that replication yields two strands leading strand and lagging strand leading strand synthesis is continuous whereas lagging strand synthesis is discontinuous short short fragments called okazaki fragments are generated in discontinuous fashion in lagging strand till this we have seen in our previous lectures now leading strand synthesis is very smooth it doesn't face any difficulties but lagging strand does as the lagging strand replication machinery reaches the end of the dna at some point primes no longer has sufficient space to synthesize a new rna primer hence a complete lagging strand synthesis is not possible that means a complete copy of its template cannot be made this is called the end replication problem so here a new primes cannot be fitted uh since the space is very less at the end this problem is fixed by telomeres enzyme human telomere consists of many repeats of the sequence 5 dash tta ggg 3 dash okay so this is the template and this is the lagging strand and this is the gap at the end now this tta ggg sequence is repeated many times in the template strand now it's the game of telomeres telomeres is a remarkable enzyme that includes both protein and rna components that's why it is called ribonucleoprotein the key to telomeres function is revealed by the rna component of the enzyme the sequence of the rna includes 1.5 copies of the complement of the telomere sequence so the rna of telomeres has sequence ggg att ggg that means it is just the complementary of dna end now this region of the rna can annul to the single stranded dna at the 3 prime end of the telomere telomeres then uses its reverse transcription activity to synthesize dna to the end why reverse transcription since dna is getting generated from rna of telomeres and the end is now filled by dna nucleotides and the gap is now filled after the completion telomeres gets displaced so this is all about today's lecture i hope you liked the lecture thank you for watching my video